morning I saw this on Fox Kids and this whole fight scene was cut out which pissed me off if you've heard me speak before I hate fucking things that cut out this is like this is the 10th anniversary special I want to see it all Fox cut out I'm glad it got the bloody uncensored version some years before so I knew that there was nothing missing that there was something missing at the time when it was on telly and of course Ten dozen stunt guys getting their ass kicked in cog suit. A Power Rangers staple when they're not using the uh, Japanese Sentai footage. Unfortunately, Power Rangers now seems to have finished. RPM seems to be, be the last American series because they seem to be doing a revitalization of the original series, probably with added special effects or some shit. I'm interested to see what they do with that, but anyone who does want to keep up with stuff. The, the Japanese series I think will still be going for a good few more years. It's been going since the 70s and I don't think it's going anywhere anytime fast. And I like that they just, they just wouldn't start whipping out the guns it's just like fuck it just shoot them down. <laughs> you have to forgive me. My voice is a bit raw. It's the first time I've done one of these in I don't know, how long, when was the last time I did one of these? Sometime earlier this year when I did that Turtles one. Hey, but at some point I'm going to do Turtles Forever Uncut. Maybe tonight or a couple of days from now, I'm not quite sure yet. Might do it after this if I can be bothered. It's just this nice to see that they're not all still fighting together, they're all getting their own individual fights. This is the point where the TV series cut back in when it cut off. It's just like you taking the mix up. So. Now the Beetleborg outfits, anyone who saw that scene, uh, saw that series, shame on you. <laughs> That's crap. But this is coming from someone who watched Power Rangers, so I've got no leg to stand on on that one. But surely they could have created like new suits and not just recycled the Beetleborg suit. Now oh, well, they're all gonna be dead in ten minutes, who gives a fuck? <sighs> I don't know you people. <laughs> Who are you again? Thank you, Rangers. Thank you, Rangers. As I say, the Galaxy Force Leo, guy demorphing, I just think we shot time. after the fact. You're just in time. Yeah. This, that was Andrews, done after the fact. The rest of him in the suit was probably stunt blow. What? Ten Red Rangers? What? Ten Jason, Rangers. cocky as ever. Uh, Let's go for it! What are we waiting for? Let's go, guys. This was in time. Ooh, I just had a cowboy moment. Sorry, uh, someone's just joining me on the messenger board. <laughs> I'll be momentarily. <laughs> Sorry, these guys, I'm sorry, it were forgettable. They were there, they got the money, they got paid, and bumped it on. Him, I didn't mind. I really liked him, because it. Okay, he was doing it for his own self, but. He was someone that cl climbed up from nothing and tried to better himself. So you gotta respect that. Let's kick some ass! Alright guys, let's do it! Come on! Alright guys, we're here to save the Earth! Let's take him down! Just because it's your series doesn't mean you're in charge, pal. You get in the back of the line and follow the adults. You've only been arranged for two fucking minutes. It's ironic, I'm doing a commentary and I am talking to someone on Messenger Board. Of course, Jason knows how to kick some ass, he's been doing it for 10 years. <laughs> Jason's a bit cocky, but he's got the right to be cocky. He's a guy that led the pack. I will go with the rest of eternity without hearing that phrase again. And everyone else just starts kicking some ass. 
Then of course we're doing a Power Rangers Doctor Who Star Trek staple. We're fighting in a quarry somewhere. And of course, here's Matrix Shop, which was around at the time. And everyone else is dog piles on what's left and kicks her out. Goodbye! That sounds a bit big for you, son. Come on, there's two of you. Big slappy dance. Come on! Goodbye! Too hot! You're dead, boy. Next! I think the majority of this episode took, it looks like it took the majority of the budget of the series because the series was never, this particular series, Wild Force, was never this good. <laughs> but I suppose it's 10th anniversary, you got to throw money at it. You ready? Let's do it. Ready? Now, I'm not quite sure if this is using Sentai footage or not. Might be because Sentai do a crossover stuff as well, which the Power Rangers lot didn't start doing until about Galaxy Force when in space met the Galaxy Force Rangers. So I'm not 100% sure on that and I've not seen a confirmation. Next one's what else? You're gone. Who cares if you have a defender of the Earth? Of course, they've kicked his ass. But he's legging it. Now why couldn't they have just used either stop motion or some like Sentai footage from the Serpent Terror series instead of this CGI crap? Okay, at that time the CGI was probably looked pretty good. And the majority of the budget probably went this episode went to it, but sorry, that looks nice. Now this I suppose in the script was where the multi zord fight was supposed to take place, but I think it would have cost too much money and probably wouldn't would have looked as crap as Serpent Terror does right now. But since it's his series and he got this less than an episode or two ago, fuck knows how driving through Serpent Terror on that destroyed it, but it's a 20 minute episode so I just have to forego the conceit. Quick, Brian! Is it not monumental to the series? Oh no! Yeah, you keep dreaming that way. Um, also, I should just briefly touch on. There was a long third April Fool called Scorpion Rain, which was supposed to explain um, what happened to Serpent Terror, which was a great April Fool at the time, but no one's quite sure. It was supposed to be um, the Zero Suits, Tommy and Catherine destroying Serpent Terror and Zed, or something like that, but no one can. It was a good April Fool that sort of fooled people for a while, but. And of course, Thank doing the done the job. Cole seems to somehow single-handedly destroy the Serpent Terror. Fuck knows how. Brothers to the end, Rangers forever. We are. We rule. We're hot. I guess it's time to say goodbye, Ken. May the power protect you all. May the power protect you all. See you next time, Rangers. Bye. So that was time. So that was. He really is the greatest Ranger. He'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> what? Well, what?
I wouldn't go that far. Well, after all, I wouldn't go that I far. was the one after that replaced all, him. I was Are you kidding me? Him. I was the one Are you kidding all me? the work while I he was the one the juice bar kissing on Kimberly. Exactly. This is haircuts regulation, right? This is haircuts regulation. My Q-Rex with his dragon sword. My Q-Rex with his dragon sword. Y'all glunts. Yeah, you would have thought they would have got the dragon sword from the bottom of the ocean wherever it's buried and done something else with it, like turned into something else. Wait, 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 wait. I mean, okay, they discard his George, but surely they must be able to turn him into something else. And that's River End. Hope you enjoyed the commentary. I'll be back sometime later when I can be bothered. Hoo ha! Peace, good night, and see ya.